Hey guys, welcome back to Call of Duty 2. Um, actually, this is going to be the first video of the series. Um, I finished up United, United Offensive just a couple days ago. Um, so we're going to go up to Call of Duty 2. And um, not sure on this one. I haven't played it in such a long time. So I can't remember what exactly goes down on here. Um, so we're going to go ahead and start a new game. And we'll take it from there. And now we should be starting the game. We can, I guess we could take the Moscow, 1941. Not totally sure what happens here, but we'll see how that goes. 1939. The armies of Nazi Germany begin their conquest of Europe. First of all is Poland, then Denmark, Norway, France, Belgium, Luxembourg, and the Netherlands. Now the year is 1941. With an army over 7 million strong, the Nazi war machine turns to the east and begins the invasion of the Soviet Union. Using blitzkrieg tactics, they advance quickly, smashing relentlessly through the Soviet defenses and arrive at the capital city of Moscow in under four months. Desperately short of reinforcements, the Soviet defense of Moscow now falls to thousands of raw recruits must hold out against the well-trained German forces in the freezing cold of the Russian winter. There you have it. Nazis can start invading Moscow and the, the Soviet Union. So it's time to fight back. So we're going to go as Private Vasily I. Koslov uh, from the 3rd Guard Rifle Div Third Guards Rifle Division. Um, so we're going to go see and how the story unfolds of this character here um, like I said I've never haven't played this game in such a long time so uh, bear with me if you know if I get lost you know it's bound to happen so I haven't played this game so uh, we'll see how that goes so we're gonna start the mission Welcome to so we're in training. training comrades if you wish to survive you will do exactly as I say now walk over to that table and pick up those weapons same control concept doesn't change Where's mines? You will have to move faster than that, comrade. You will need a real weapon if you wish to kill the fascists. Look at your compass. The star on the compass shows the location of your current objective. Now go to the storeroom and get a pistol and a rifle. Move! The weapons are on the table, comrade. Good. Now go back and report to the commissar. Very good, comrade. Always remember to use the star on your compass to reach your current objective. Okay, Vasily. Let us see how good your aim is. Aim for one of those two teddy bears. Not so good, comrade. All right, fire at one of those bears again. Good, now fire at the other one. Pistols and submachine guns might be good for short range, comrade. But for long range targets, a rifle is better. Step up to the shooting range. Ready, comrades? Shoot those bottles and plates. Imagine that they are the enemy. All right, let's see. Oh, had a reload, of course. The graphics on this is a lot better. A little more step up. Vasily. Now, let's see how well you can do under pressure. You have 15 seconds to Hold on, guys. I'll be right back. Sorry about that, guys. Um, I just had to go do a couple things. Um, let's just shoot as many. So, it's... Now, come over here and bash this mannequin with your rifle. That's enough, comrade. Come over here and pick up a grenade. These are potatoes, comrade commissar. Why are we using potatoes instead of real grenades? Because real grenades are valuable. In fact, they are worth a lot more than you are. What an asshole. <laughs> Come on, my, my mistake. Now throw a potato into each of those marked target areas. Good throw. Very good, comrade. Good throw. Comrade Commissar! Comrade Commissar! We've got a prisoner. Come take a look. 
Well, we're gonna find out what kind of brother we have. Which most likely is a German. German soldier. Hopefully a German officer. So we're gonna follow a commissioner here. Listen, comrades. There is an armory to the east in the basement of a house. Go there and load up on ammunition and supplies. I will stay and take care of our guest. Remember what you have learned. Good luck. <laughs> and I had to throw some of those uh, potatoes at him. Alright, here we go. Got a lorry because I think it's a little too loud for my taste, but um, you guys can't hear. I might have to pull it up back up again. So we'll see how. Um, it's a little loud, so. Um, okay. Alright then, that was a good explosion. So this one changes a lot of the gaming. Uh, you can see that there's no more health health packs anymore. Um, you lose quite a bit of stuff. Um, the weapons are, I think they're just normal weapons. They're not as strong as you would you like it to be. Like, so a lot of a lot of stuff has changed during this uh, Call of Duty 2, you know and. Well, I had to explode that somehow. Continue. I don't think you can. I don't think you can run on this one. So. My God! I thought we were in training. There is no better training, comrade, than fighting to survive. <laughs> Very true. But anyways, guys, that's the first part of the Call of Duty 2. Um, we're going to go ahead and stop it here for today. Uh, we're going to continue uh, the level uh, again. 
after this second video so thank you guys for watching those who guys watch thank you guys for watching this video also new anybody new for my channel go ahead and please subscribe and also um, give it a like or thumbs up to this video thank you and have a nice day guys